But first, Trooper Baker and Detective Cass have someone else they want to speak with. We are sorry for the loss of your son. The person who discovered the two bodies. Any, Mike Jr.'s heartbroken father. Could help us with this case. Having a conversation like this with parents that have just lost a child is very emotional. And that was part of the case from beginning to end. Everyone was so emotionally involved in the case that we took it personally. See if any enemies, to see if any The first thing Baker and Cass want to know is who might want to hurt their son. We have a nephew, his name is Judd. Mike Sr. is quick to mention Judd Owens, his nephew and a former employee. He had worked for the Allstate Concrete Company for several years. And you owe me money! Man. You're getting paid for eight hours a day! The dispute had arisen oh, over overtime wages. Us too, man! I was there ten hours You're a day! So and it resulted in Judd filing a lawsuit against the Zimini family. Take it or leave it. Screw you, man. Take it somewhere else, man. I will! Poor neighbor. Mike Jr.'s mother has someone else in mind. And he would hang around my daughter. She mentions a neighbor up at their summer home in Freedom, New Hampshire, Sean Fitzpatrick. She had concerns about the relationship between Michelle, her daughter-in-law, and the neighbor, Sean. In her opinion, okay, Sean was always flirting with Michelle when Mike Jr. wasn't around. She had seen Michelle in a embrace with See you Sean. Later, okay? She thought that this embrace was somewhat inappropriate and that it was a little more than a hug. That's all either of Mike's parents can think of, given their state of grief. So the investigators ask them to call if anything else comes to mind. As police focus on the two leads, the town rumor mill is stirring up several different theories about who's behind the double homicide. The rumors were flying down the street. It's possible that Mike Jr. may have had a few more enemies than anybody thought. And as detectives dig deeper, they uncover forces at work bigger than anyone is expecting. We can get this done somewhere else. It's a cement company after all. We're at the end of the big dig. Gut instinct of a lot of people was whether or not this was mob related. 